Recognize your emperor. Holy moly. All right. Well, I mean, we still got some time. We got 20 minutes left. So let's do another one. Uh, okay. So I think we could play a little faster. Right? We could play a little faster. Duck. Duck is pretty strong. All right. Give me, give me a pill bug. So duck, when I sell it, it gives the shop animals plus one health. I mean, a beaver is not bad. Right? Another cell thingy. We put the thing with the most damage up front. We could freeze another beaver. Try to get a level three. And, uh, well, we were just holy something, right? So, let's, let's be an uncertain phantom. Because sometimes, sometimes in the, in the darkness of the night, not even I know what's going on. Man, right? Not even I know what's going on. I watched a bunch of spooky videos yesterday. So, if you guys know what Friday Nights at Freddy's is, and uh, I think there's a another popular one that's more recent called Oppie's Playtime, I think. I, listen, I am not a horror person by any mean at all. But, I always do like to learn about the lore in these games. So I was just spending the entirety of yesterday just like lying in bed watching stuff. I always spook myself because when it was nighttime and I took my, my, my dishes out to like go wash them. I'm like, ah, would be a shame if something just, I don't know, just crawled over the, the corner of the room to, to stab me. Oh, that'd be, that'd be awful. Dude. I mean, the ant army is clearly here. <laughs> Victory worthy of the Emperor? Oh, bro, I'm taking it, man. I'm taking it. I'm gonna sell it because I'm buying each and every one of these. So we want the pill bug to buff one ant, one beaver. Oh, I definitely need the ants up front. We'll do it like this. Uh, we can roll one time. Another ant, sure. Alright, well... The bugs are back in town. You know what's crazy to me? Is that I, I used to live in... Well, some of my family members used to live in some areas. Had some really, really bad, like, ant infestations. You know? Like, I used to go by one of my grannies. And in her place, like... As much as we would clean and stuff, there would be so many ants in, like, the kitchen counters and stuff. And I always wonder, like, where are they coming from? We barely drew. We barely drew, by the way. But a draw is a win. My ice. All right, Mr. Pillbug, you've done your work. Um, I guess I don't need to sell you just yet. Huh, a puppy? So if I end my turn with two or more gold, the puppy goes up. I mean, sure, we can try it. So what I would need to I would need to sell one of these to buy something else I could sell a beaver to buy a croissant but uh, I mean well we don't really need a beaver I was about to say we don't need a pill bug either but I should have done it in the other order I should have sell the pill bug first I can sell a pill bug. We'll buy another ant. Maybe get a level 3 ant. And then we'll buy it. Oh, right. Oh, I can't buy the croissant because it costs more than. It costs 3 gold, so I won't have 2 gold for the puppy to go up. Mistakes have been made. Um. Alright, well. We'll do our best. Okay, well, I can't spend the money because I want this to be buffed. Yes. So next turn, we'll buy a croissant to help the puppy to scale up a lot faster. All right. Usually come from the outside when there's a lot of heat, especially near water. I mean, I guess there, there was a well outside. I don't know if it was covered or not. But. I, I just bring that up because, like, not that I am in my current house. I haven't seen, like, any bugs like that. Ah, dang it. 
It just had exactly six damage. All right, well, we got our first loss. Not the worst thing. Uh, let's buy a croissant. Let us... We could buy... Apple, maybe, but... I don't think so. We can buy one more thing here. I think let's buy... Let's buy ourselves a rat. Let's buy ourselves a rat. So we have five units on the team. I'm gonna put the beaver up front. Why? I don't know. Feeling spicy. I could roll one time. Just to see what we get. Another ant. It was worth it. No, am I going to keep this ant around? Because if I am... Actually, I saw a little trick. You can actually use a sh the, the fried shrimp on something with low HP like this. If I'm going to combine it, I get the, the damage, I think. I think I get the damage from it. Huh. I don't really know how the trick goes. This is why you should have talked about stuff you're not you're not familiar with, man. But I could give it to one of the ants because it only takes about one HP anyway. Or I could give it to the puppy actually, because the puppy scales. Hmm. Look at this wasp in the back. Shop tier. Gain fifty percent more attack. Holy crap. So if you get a if you get a wasp early, that can go off. Is this a level three ant that I see? Um, excuse me. Okay, I can only buy. I can only buy two things, right? Because we're not gonna immediately upgrade a puppy, I don't think we grab that just yet. We can grab it. Level 3 ant. Oh, to buy a buffalo. To purchase a buffalo would make me so happy. I think, yo, I'm going to do the unprecedented. I'm going to run a three-man squad. You know why? Because I'm a, dude, I'm going to be scaling so fast. I have the health to lose, right? I can sell a rat. We can sell a beaver. And then we can buy a bison. Like we have the level 3 ant. So the bison will buff itself. We have 3 gold. So the puppy buffs itself. Uh, I guess we just have to find a way for the ant to scale. But I mean it's an ant. It's designed to die. Right? We're going to roll one time to see what we find. And we find nothing. So. I do want to buy this shrimp. Next turn I'm going to buy... Two animals, maybe, to fill the spots. So, I don't think we freeze the shrimp anymore. Dude, if I can draw or win with this team, it'll be so good for it. Because we are scaling at insane speeds right now. What are we fighting? A three squad as well? How lucky for us. Dude, can I get any luckier? The one time we use a three squad ourselves, we fight someone with three squad. Ah, all right. Well, do we want a goldfish? Ooh. If I buy two goldfish separately, it'll make the thing on the left. The two leftmost costs one less. So I can buy two animals for... For one, right? The problem is, is that this this would be my turn buying two goldfish. I'm not really getting any stronger doing that, but I mean we're scaling, so it doesn't really matter. We don't have to really rely on these. I do need this puppy at some point. Let's see if we can find another ox, another bison, or another puppy. Unfortunate, but we find another croissant. Could be useful. We can put it on our ant. The ant's damage will go up. Look, the boys in the back, they're just eating. They're just devouring. They're having a good time.
So, I'm hoping that now that we added some more stuff, it doesn't go bad for us. Oh, dude, dude. what is this team, man? My aunt can solo carry that. Oh, aunt's gonna die. Not used to the professional fit? Dude. I told myself I could change. I could change out of my out of my business attire, but why not a little extra snazzy? Right? Why not? Seeing as this might go up to YouTube as well, for those that might be watching on YouTube, I, I just got a an interview. I just got done with an interview um for a job position, so fingers crossed that. In the future, your boy would be, might be a, a working lad, you know? Contributing member of society. All right, we can buy one more thing. I think we keep the goldfish for now. We just buy a croissant. Let me roll once. I mean, a level two goldfish. Why not? Why not? I should put my damage things up front. I don't know why they're so far back. I'm not sure. Given the audience that slice of life vibes, I have never actually understood what slice of life genre in anime really meant. Like, what does it really mean? Oh my god. You see this level 3 ant? 22.15? How did it die? No, they won. I have no idea how we lost. I have no idea how we killed their thing. But, I mean, we have a level 3 bison, a level 2 bison. For one gold, by the way. We have a level 2 fish. For one gold, by the way. I do want a fox. Actually, we could sell this. It's gone to two most left, uh, two left most shot pets by two. Stupid to the level of the peasants and the subjects. I'll definitely be one of the, uh, I'll be the one paying taxes for a change. Listen, outside of my stream, I wish it wasn't a thing, man. I wish. I'll put this here. And I can buy a fox. I mean, unfortunately, the fox would take the, the pineapple. Okay. So, because the fox would take a useless item for us right now. I think we buy the crocodile. We keep two gold so that the puppy scales up. We freeze the fox. So that at the start of the next turn, we get a discount on it. Right? So we can buy it for one gold anyway. And then maybe we can steal like a better, a better, um, drop thingy. Uh, let's put the crocodile up front. It has a lot of damage and no HP, so it could trade with whatever. And uh, even if it doesn't, the goldfish can get a kill. We put the bison at the back so that when the ant dies, the bison gets a lot of stats. Yeah, I like this. Bison is killing plus four plus four also. Because it's a level two. Ah, I mean to be able to play Super Auto Pass again is, is really nice. To be able to play anything again is really nice. You're gonna shoot the bison in the back? Hey look, it's me. But oh, they have a grown-up dog. Goodbye. See ya. Super buffed. Our bison is better. A level two puppy, finally, finally. Uh, okay, so we can sell. Ooh, what is this? A stew. Give three random pets plus two health. Hmm. Let's start here. A snake is pretty good. A snake is pretty pretty good. I think I have a video of us winning with a snake on the team. Up on YouTube. So, let's sell a crocodile. Let's buy a fox. Get our discount. 
what am I thinking here? So you'll go up by 4 4. You'll go up by 4 4. I actually think we can sell the goldfish. I know I see one here, but we could maybe sell the goldfish. We could consider a lynx as well. Because the lynx will do damage based on everyone's levels. Hmm. What? Two, seven, eight, nine. It'll do nine damage to a random thing. Or five damage every time something attacks. Nah, snake is better. We can sell this. We can buy a snake. This. We can freeze a stew, that's for sure. No. We can buy one thing. Hey, old Twinkie. That's good, Twinkie. Thank you so much for paying taxes. Welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome in. We're playing some super auto pets and we're trying to use our big brains. How have you been, Twinkie? Uh, so, I can buy one thing. And it won't be any of these. I can roll one more time and still buy one thing. Okay. Well, Fortune Cookie says attack has a 50% chance to deal a double damage. Worst thing. Let's give it to our snake. So the snake will be behind the bison. The bison should attack a lot, which means the snake shoots a lot. The fox is here in the middle because we want the ant, when it dies, to buff the only remaining strong unit on our team with... Damage and health. And now the fox will steal the stew. And three random animals should get plus two health. Plus four, plus four. Plus four, plus four. Plus one. I mean, hey. It works out pretty good. We just gotta survive. You taxes? I think I'm gonna be sick. You know, that same tax money goes into paying the doctors that keeps you healthy. Right? Been busy, but good. Glad to hear that. I'm glad to hear it. How am I? I am pretty much been the same. I have been busy, which is why I've taken a lot of time from streaming. Um, I think it's what almost a month now that I didn't really stream that often. But I finished exams yesterday, and I I'm here to chill. I'm here to chill. I'm going to try to stream five days a week, Wednesday to Sunday. Dude, look at our snake. Look at our snake, dude. Our bison and snake are just carrying at this point. We got the front line and we got the damage dealer in the back. But yeah, I definitely will try to do a lot more frequent streams and a lot more structured streams as well. Wednesdays are going to be like a uh, roguelike gauntlet where we play a roguelike game. We spin a wheel, play a roguelike game for like an hour or so. We're doing that right now, actually, which is why we're playing Super Auto Pets. Um... Thursday, Friday is going to be like story oriented games. So the one I'm going to play tomorrow is called Rogue Legacy. Rogue Legacy 2, actually. I've been watching a lot of it. It looks super fun, super um, fantastic. Great music. Saturday is Community Day. And Sunday is... Whatever goes, honestly. Another fox? Sure, we could freeze it. One more roll. Nothing we really care for. If I can get a level 3 bison, it'll be scaling exponentially. Oh right, the fox is going to steal something at random. I guess it doesn't really matter. The grape says that I gain one goal at the start of every turn. Sure. Steal me some grapes. Or steal me some honey. That's, that's fine. You need a higher tax bracket for Anthony? <laughs> what do you mean? Anthony will pay? I mean, Anthony doesn't even pay shit, man. My fox. Anthony don't pay shit. Dude, all... Please shoot the ox. Dang it, shoot the ox, man. Once again. 
Once again, hard carried by the snake. Hard carry. Access pay the doctors if if only your empire had free healthcare. This guy, man, I swear. Not tax the rich. I I tax the rich. What do you mean? Oh, I wish I could tax you. No. I could buy this. I could buy this to get a level 3 bison. What are you? Alpaca? Friend summoned? Give it plus 1 experience. Ooh, except other alpacas. Huh. Works 2 times per turn. So if I bought this, whatever else I buy will get plus 1 experience. That's That's interesting. That's kind of interesting. Well, I mean, we won't really change our team at this point. If two random pets plus four damage, I actually think we don't roll here because we want to steal the hot dog, right? Let's do this. We'll steal the hot dog. Fortunately, it went to these two. It's really not good for us. Let's see how this goes, though. We got a gorilla up front with the pepper tech. I mean, the gorilla gets off guaranteed 14 damage. But it doesn't matter. Because we're super strong. <laughs> the kangaroo is dead. My god. My god, we solved it. Gonna go on Elon. Are you gonna go all Elon Musk on us? Own 52% of this empire? Yo, if you got the money, bro, I will, I will sell out, all right? We already kind of gave Lauren's, uh, Lauren the, um, the channel. I was like, yo, chat. Rate the fit out of three. Lauren was like, a thousand. I'm like, yeah, yo. So the channel is yours at this point. The channel is freaking yours. I don't mind. Call me crazy, if you will. Let's freeze ourselves some stew. Which is kind of funny, because when you think about it, I'm thinking about it. What I was thinking about is if I bought a, a, a white tiger and I put it behind the snake, it'll make the snake a level three snake. The issue with that though is that the snake needs to be behind something that will attack multiple times. So even though it's a level three, it has to be behind this, which means this won't do a thing. This won't do a thing. So we don't take the white tiger. You have a pet popcorn? Summon a random pet from the same tier after fainting? Hmm. I mean, we could give this to our snake. Our snake is not very strong, so double damage on the snake doesn't really do much. We could roll. We could roll. We could roll one more time. Another fox. We'll take this next turn. The issue here is that I don't want to buy the salad bowl. Because then the dog won't scale. I hope the fox steals the stew. Maybe I can roll one more time and find something better. Popcorn again. It's not the worst thing. It's actually better than the honey. So I guess we take this. Please steal the stew. They took the popcorn. So be it. So be it. 151k channel points. Oh my god. Why do you have so many, man? Don't kill my snake, man. What are you doing? My snake. <laughs> I summoned another fox. Alright, puppy. It's all up to you. Oh, dude. We got this easy, man. The puppy is the last line of defense, but... Holy smokes. Up he goes off. We can buy ourselves a fox. White tiger, I don't need you. So, steal a random shop food. Health and attack effects are multiplied by two. So, if I buy this, or if I steal it, I give three random pets four health. Or, I give two random pets eight health. What? What's more important, health? 
Health is more important on the bison. So I think we buy the hot dog. It went on like some bad units, but that's all right. I think we just take the stew. Our puppy's almost maxed. Our bison is almost maxed. Dude, we're kind of going off. We're going to shoot the puppy in the back. Level three. Level three turkey. Uh oh. Kill the turkey, please. Is someone a turkey? Dude. If we don't get 10 wins. If we don't get 10 wins, that's all I'll say. Like, how do we not get 10 wins? I can't even buy another bison. <laughs> There's kind of nothing to buy here. Like, once we get to level... Like, after this turn, we can sell the ant, but the ant has so many stats. I actually think, at this point, it's better to give the puppy some, like, garlic. Like, ideally, we'd want to give the puppy, like, a pepper or melon armor. I'll buy it for no. We could steal a chicken leg. And they give the fox plus six plus six. Which, again, is not the worst of the worst. We could freeze it. What is a hyena? Start of battle, swamp, attack, and health of all pets? I think not. No, no, no. Another chicken leg? When a friend faints, give a random friend plus three plus two. Ah. Uh, I think we just rock with what we have, honestly. All right. Potential last game. 50-50 on our ox. Let's see. No scorpions, please. There's no scorpion. Don't shoot my don't shoot my snake. Didn't shoot the snake. Shoot their snake though. I'll take that. Oh my god. This dog is just ordering delivery. But it doesn't matter. Dude. Back to back wins on the first day. I'm taking it, man. Like we crush that. We crush that. Early puppy into early bison into level three, well, level three ant way before that, but still, dude, we're lucky. That's all I'll say. We're lucky.